Things are changing around here. I've given myself the challenge in 2017 to not buy anything new. This includes toys, books, clothes, home stuff, DVDs, everything like that I will be buying second hand. Now there will obviously be some exceptions. My sister-in-law is having a baby in April and I will most certainly be buying her a gift but I will do my best to support small businesses when I do this. This is a bit of a fight to counteract consumerism. I see it in my thinking and I don't like it one single bit. I hate that we live to earn money to buy stuff. I will either be buying secondhand from charity shops or secondhand used from eBay. And yeah, it's gonna be a massive challenge for me. This is all in an attempt to have a simpler life. When you get rid of stuff and you have less things around you to distract you, you can focus more on the things that really matter, like your family members and your extended family members. You'll have more time to spend with them, more time to give to your hobbies and the things that really matter to you in life. Hopefully my life will be less about collecting, owning and buying stuff and more about giving and being a community, giving out of myself, inspiring others. So I've been through my wardrobe, I took everything out, put it on the bed, sorted it into piles of stuff that I wanted to keep, stuff to give to charity and stuff that I just wasn't sure if I would wear. The stuff I wasn't sure if I would wear I put in a suitcase and put under our bed. Now all the things left in my wardrobe and my drawers are things that I really hope to wear in the next month and if I don't they will be going straight to charity as well. And I've also done the same with my beauty and I've done the same with all the boys toys. This is not so that I can buy more stuff and replace the old things, it's just to have less stuff. I've already seen the benefits of this. And when I'm walking around the house, I'm no longer tripping over piles of toys, of clothes, and we haven't got baskets of laundry around just sitting there that are clean, but don't, we don't need, actually need, so they're not going back in the wardrobe. Yeah, I literally am loving it. My house feels so less cluttered, except for all the bunches of stuff that we're giving to charity, but that won't be there for long. I really want this to teach me to be happy with what I have and what I own and not looking to achieve another lifestyle. If there are things we need, like I know we will be needing some new bedding soon as we got a set for our wedding which was nearly seven years ago so it's quite like old and um, tearing in places and stuff and wearing away and then we've got another cheap set which is just from Primark and it's actually quite stained so I will probably be investing in some new bedding sheets um, but that is literally the only thing I can think of that will be buying new for us everything else I'm happy with. My husband is totally on board with this. We watched a documentary called The Minimalists together and, and before that we'd been clearing out anyway but this was kind of just to inspire us and it is amazing. It's all about how the world's just living to earn more money, to earn more power and um, to look great and to have more stuff and we just, that's not what we're living for so we've just ended it. It will also help us save some money, which we are always looking to do because we live off of one salary. My husband works really hard to support our family and the money that we will save will be going towards a, eventually a house at some point. It is the kind of thing that is easy to slip back into, so we really hope that we don't, um, but we will obviously keep you guys updated. And yeah, I hope you have enjoyed this video and that you feel inspired to get rid of things and to not be buying endlessly, to think about what you buy. We are not really against consumerism, we love having nice things around us, but it's just the extent. I hope you guys are up for the challenge with me and let me know if you think about doing anything like this yourself. This isn't a New Year's resolution per se, but you could see it like that. We are just trying something new for the year in an attempt to have a more simplified life. If you are making any changes in your life, please let me know in the comments below. Give this video a like and subscribe. And thank you so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. Happy New Year!